Good day, Hot Wheels peeps. Um, I got my other box today. Well, it was last night, but I was so busy yesterday with the eBay stuff. Was on eBay listing stuff and going through cars and stuff, the pictures and stuff I showed you for from the time I finished until that. So about 10 hours. So sorry it took so long for yesterday's video to pop up until last night. For some reason, it did it. It processed it. I wrote on it, and for some reason, it never went through, and I didn't notice it until late last night after I finished for 10 hours messing with the cars, so sorry for that, but most of the stuff is on there. There's more stuff I'm going to put on there today. I think there's still like 15, 20 more listings of stuff I have to put on there, um, so you guys know. Um, with that being said... I got a box from Mr. Mr. Lunford. This is the what I was waiting for. I also went to Toys R Us this morning because there's a Toys R Us that hadn't. They changed the colors of the bags. They're now purple, blue, and orange. I don't know, but um, went to Toys R Us this morning because I know one of them gets trucks on Tuesday. Went over there and. Still didn't have what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the Green Machine, the new Green Machine Muscles Challenger. I'm looking for the Chase one. They haven't received the muscle cars yet, so that's why I keep going there and looking. Once they receive them, I probably won't go back to the store for probably a month or two because that's just not a Toys R Us that I normally hit anymore. Um, other than that, this is the second time I've walked into the store, and there's been... Dots and Bluebirds hanging on the pegs. I started not to grab them. However, one's just a regular one. It's not a big deal. But this one had the smooth grill. But not only that, the card's kind of flimsy. The guy was just throwing stuff up there. I know it looks like all the paint is on it. You have, you have to, let me see if I can do this. Maybe that'll help. There's not a lot of paint on the front of the car. I know, but, oh, that's not an error. You're right, it's not. It's just something different, especially for the smooth grill. It hardly hit the front of the car. So, I have a red one that is mis doesn't have no paint on the front. The headlights, the grill, nothing. There's no paint on it at all. Not even a dot. So, I'll probably put that one with it. Other than that, didn't find nothing else at the store that I wanted. So I just checked out and left. Um, went to an HEB, which is, I've mentioned before, a Texas-based store. Still no DC comic cars. However, someone had posted, I'm opening up the box while I'm talking. Someone had posted on a Facebook page about they found the Mastio Harley Davidson cars in sets for like a buck. So I went to check, and lo and behold, did I not find out Ooh, that, I'm going to wait to look at that. That's nice. Um, to find out that they, the, that store, and it's a bigger store than the one closer to my house, the one or two closer to my house. It's a bigger store. And they're discontinuing green light cars and Mastio cars. So, my chances of getting green light cars now is just strictly Toys R Us and eBay or trades or something. But as far as stores, it's now just Toys R Us. That's it. Um, I went in and didn't find any because they was already all sold because I asked the lady, I said, I was in here Sunday. You had green light cars up. I talked to some guy on the, on the um, display aisle. He said Tuesday there was, that they was probably going to be marked down to a buck. So that's why I showed up. I can't find the discontinued items. And she walked me over there to the aisle. That was The whole aisle was nothing but discontinued stuff. And because they're remodeling the store or something. And nothing. They had hot little Hot Wheels. I didn't buy any. Little Hot wheel sets or something. You know, like with, the, with like a, just a garage in the car or something. They were a buck. They're usually $5. But I don't want those. So I just left them. So, I don't know. But anyway, let's get to this. As you see, I already opened up that end. It's got a nick in it, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to complain. 
Throw that over there. I can reuse that box. This is it's an international card. Let me get it closer. It's an international card. I didn't know. I didn't ask. I really didn't care. Um, debating on eBay with this because I can flip it for what I paid. I can get triple for what I paid because uh, I bought the card. Guy posted on the thing, so I went ahead and bought it for a couple bucks. I pretty much all I paid was basically shipping. Um, maybe a couple other bucks. This is nice. I think this is supposed to be in J case. So I think it's the next case that comes out here. Because H case just hit at some stores. Ford Escort. The 70 Ford Escort. Ford Escort RS 1600. That thing is freaking awesome. It is the Fast and Furious. But there's the car. There's the front. It's got the plastic things in the front. I think are supposed to be like the rally lights. That's very interesting. Because I am assuming by looking at this. It's got a plastic bottom. Um, by looking at this. Because the window is the same color as those. It's not the interior. The interior is that plastic chrome. So, I'm wondering if these plastic lights are going to be connected to that windshield. If someone, once they hit, I'll take one apart. Just to check. Curiosity. And I'll probably switch the gold wheels on it anyway. And put some real rider gold wheels or something. But there's that car. That is awesome. So, thanks a lot. I don't see. Oh, wait, what's that? Huh. On the card, it's it's got it too. So it's supposed to be there. I don't think you guys can see. I'm gonna have to get a magnifying glass or wait till I put up one. It's probably not gonna show. On this one side, over here next to where the plastic in the card hits. See the little red spot. I think it's a word or something. And then Hot Wheels is on the bottom. They didn't paint the headlights or tail lights. This car would be a really good car to do a custom to. I think that would be very interesting. So I'm fixing to think about trying to attempt to take a Silverado. The Hot Wheels meeting here, the custom contest of Silverados. That's not what I wanted. Although, and I said I'm not going to do one. I've been wondering how people are making the hoods and the trunks and stuff open of what they're using. Well, someone told me that they're taking apart green light cars or other stuff. And the little latches that's connected to the hood that connect on the inside, usually somewhere. They're taking those off and they're switching them out and they're using JB Weld or whatever. And they're cutting the hood out. Because I'm going to try one of these. And they're cutting the hood out. Oops, sorry. They're going to cut the hood out and then they're sticking it to where it opens and shuts. Of course, then you have to put a motor in the car too. Because if you open it, there's nothing there. So, I'll have to find something that fits. Or cut a hole in the hood so that way it'll open and shut with a big motor. I haven't decided yet. But I think I'm going to try to attempt that. I've got those customs I'm still working on for somebody. So, um, with this weather on and off and everything, I'm trying to find a particular pink color. And I haven't found it yet. I still, I've got the tempos copied in my file folder. Although I have not printed them out yet to stick on the cars. Uh, I've got a trailer that's plastic and has given me hell with this paint. So... There, I'm still working on those. That's my main goal is to try to get those done by this weekend. So hopefully. Um, other than that, nothing else to do. Hopefully you guys, I mentioned in the other video, Kev's underscore diecast eBay. I've got more stuff to list sometime today. Um, nothing else. Nothing else at all. This, you may go and this, this may or may not be on there. I haven't decided yet. I'll decide when I have to take pictures later because I have a Mustang 
uh, bin or whatever. I have a lot of Mustangs that I put all together that I, I didn't take pictures of last night because I forgot. So, I'm saying I was exhausted. Um, nothing else, nothing else, nothing else. With that being said, hope you guys have a good day and bye-bye.